Alright guys, so we're going to talk about putting an IDW in a vendor, okay? So to do that, it's pretty simple. You go to, I've already downloaded my files uh, off Canvas, so I'm going to hit open. I save it in the desktop. I'm going to hit the top shelf board, open it up in IPT. It comes in black, don't really like black, but it'll work, okay? So once we have the IPT open, we hit file new standard IDW the thing about inventor is you gotta change the sheet size so right click on sheet 1-1 one, one, edit sheet change it to size A paper from D to A you'll see it shrinks hit base view you'll see it there so I hit OK drag it over to the left just a little bit using the red boxes hit project view directly above it with dotted lines directly beside it with dotted lines, 3D. Right click, create. Then go to annotate, hit dimension. <clears throat> Make three dimensions. You need to hit the length, hit OK. Height, hit OK. And the thickness, hit OK. Then I need to dimension the holes. So I'm going to do a center dot to the edge. This one I'm going to change the precision on it to three decimal points, just so I can make sure I did it right. Center dot to the edge. Okay. Middle one, center dot to the edge. Go above it. Hit okay. Um, then I need to do how far it is from the back edge. Notice that I did not um, I'm going to do this backwards, and this is the only dimension I'm going to use in this category. Okay. Actually, then I'm going to drag this out just a little bit. everything back to dimensioning you notice I'm not dimensioning all these because this is the same hole all the way through edge to the end click OK hit edge to the next edge go above it. I'm going to change precision on it three decimal points click OK and that is it. I've dimensioned all the holes. This is two across, right? Because this is the same spot. These are 0.38 down. Okay, so all those things um, are marked.